This video is sponsored by BuyCheapMuckCoins.com. Make sure you head on over there for all your Muck coin purchases. Use code GS5 for a discount at checkout. Welcome to week 14 and the 11 franchises we got going on. We are the Pittsburgh Steelers, and I want to say we are 3 and 10 at this point. Or no, was it 3 and 9 because of the bye week? I'm not sure. Uh, our record is really bad. Like, really, 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 really bad. Uh, yeah, it's 3 and 9. It's 3 and 9. Because um, I remember if we finish outright, like a queen sleep sweep of the rest of the season, we'll finish 7 and 9. And that will give us absolutely nothing. We are not the Seahawks when they won the division. The Cow I mean, the Ravens lead the division. They have a big lead. Uh, I'm going up against this all Madden nonsense, which is damn near impossible to beat for me. Um, especially with the random playbooks that I'll be picking. Sometimes I'll be having trouble. Um, and the playbook I land on, of course, I land on a playbook. I believe it was Mike Dicka, where there's no shotgun. And I'm like, oh, you got to be kidding me. Like, how come nobody ran shotgun before, like, 2003? Like, really? So, we got to try and make it do what it do, man. Uh, but he definitely had some good run plays in there, which obviously tried to let us utilize um, bad throw by me. That right there, can't blame nobody but me. That was a bad throw. Well, we tried to utilize LaShawn McCoy as we're going up against Money Man Zell. Um What was, you know, frustrating again is that when I was in, look at the broken tackles. When I was in a must-pass situation, it's like I got to come back and, like, single back, like, I can't even run screens because running under center screens is really tough because the pressure is almost immediate. You know, you don't have that five-yard gap from when you're in a shotgun to try and, you know, get rid of the ball to give you, you know, like an extra second or two. Under center, as soon as you hike it, right there in your face. So it's tough to get rid of the ball and just no shotgun. We're dealing with no shotgun. Right here, he throws over towards the right, and they score just like that. Uh, you know, taking the first lead of the game. I'm thinking to myself, another game, another game where we lose. Uh, oh, but LaShawn, LaShawn McCoy may have something different to do with that. Maybe, maybe he feels like we can win this game. Right there's a big stop for them. Forces us third and four. Really quick comeback route, and we end up picking up the much-needed first down. Again, we go back to LaShawn McCoy. I'm just trying to find some outside, man. Trying to make a move and, and get, um, get some space going. Like right here, we end up just finding a seam, getting the first down, which is big. Again, we go back to LaShawn McCoy, but we run right into a defender. Right here, second and 13. Try to get rid of the ball, but I could not. He was wide open, too. Third and 13 right here, and we're forced to punt the ball. So we're down 0-7. to seven and a receive ball that right there definitely a good punt got him on a five yard line i got stuck but it's okay i was in g strokes mode baby i was in g strokes mode uh right there just good pass by the man hit me with the uh, pa crosses and uh good play right there actually he breaks the sack but we still get the sack by palu malu right here he goes over towards the right side on the flat so we bottle that up third and 17 they get his first down i'm breaking something he goes over towards the right side and thankfully he ends up uh getting stopped Whereas fourth and six was like, okay, we got ourselves to stop. Maybe we can, you know, tie the game. Of course, that guy comes absolutely unblocked and almost kills me. So first and ten, we go back to LaShawn McCoy. We got some room outside. And um, this was live streamed. By the way, link is in the description, by the way. Link is in the description. I'm going to need you guys to follow that live stream. Watch these games live, baby. Come hang out with your boy. Come hang out with your boy, baby. Right here, we try to run up the middle. Oh, yeah, so it's live stream. And all I, was, all I kept saying is give me blocks and watch me do work. Let me put my hard hat on and let me go to work. LaShawn McCoy is ready to go to work. I'm going to need just a little blocking. Just a little bit. And watch me go to work. So it's 7-7. Seven to seven. We're going into halftime with the tie game. That doesn't happen often. So I'm feeling, I'm feeling, you know, decently comfortable right now. So right here, second and six. Run the ball. Beautiful block shit right there by Haloti Hanata. Right here, he goes deep. And we swat that. And I'm like, oh, my goodness. You got to be kidding me. We actually may take the lead. So we have to at least get in field goal range right here to tie the game or to take the lead. And, of course, we're going back to LaShawn McCoy. We got to see him. Give me some blocking and watch me go to work. That's all I need. Yeet. All I need is just the Scotia blocking. That's it. I'm not asking for much. I'm not asking for 12 pancakes. All I need is a little bit. I don't, I don't need the whole pancake. Just a little flapjack. Just a little flapjack. Baby, that's going to be the title of this video. Just the little flapjack. That's all I need. All I need. Just a little flapjack, and I'm gone, baby. Watch me go to work. That's what happens when you give LaShawn McCoy just a Scotia blocking. Right here, we send it. Le Doolage, and we get the money means out. Third and 11, he goes over towards the left, but he got the Ronald McDonald big old feet, and he steps out of bounds. And I'm like, whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. You telling me I can take a two-possession lead on the computer? 
I don't know, Madden, with the Mike Dicker playbook that has no shotgun. You're kidding me, right? You're kidding me, right? I'm like, let's do this, baby. Right here, we try to go to the screen. Ah, we just have enough speed to sneak towards the outside, pick up the first down. Right here, we go back to the run with uh, Reese. So actually, does a good job of falling forward for like an extra yard or two. Then we go back to McCoy. See right there, you're supposed to pick up that outside, Reese. You completely bailed on that. Third and five, we go to a corner route. We read man to man, and we actually pick up another first down, putting us in field goal range right here. Look at me milking. One second on the, on the play clock is beautiful. It's beautiful. Right here, one second on the play clock again. It's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. First down will continue to let us kill the clock. And we get it. Let's go, McCoy. Right here, we get to waste some more time, which allows us to go on ahead and uh, have them start burning their timeouts. Because I'm playing for a field goal right here. I'm not taking any chances. Just a quick little safe screen. If I score, great. If I don't, hey, that's fine. They're going to waste their time out. But, of course, right there, I would roll out of bounds, right? I would. Like, I would roll out. But we have a two-possession lead. They have only two timeouts, so they're going to need a, a score and an onside kick. Uh, one stop, and we actually win. And that never happens. Right there, again, they attack the flash, but he runs out of bounds. Thank you, True Step. Right, they go through the play action. Breaks the first sec, but he does not escape the second. Third and 15, just a really quick throw towards the flats, and I completely missed that tackle. Right here on fourth down. Oh, my God. I, I thought it was right there. I break break tackles. That's, that's all they do is break tackles, man. That's all they do. I promise you. That's all they do. Another throw. They destroyed the flat routes, too, man. They just throw these little routes towards the sideline. Right here, just throws a bullet over there towards the left side. A little under a minute remaining right here. Another bullet. Quick little slant as Palomalu just destroys them right there. They decide to go with the... Um, the spike, them having no timeouts right here. Third and 16. He rolls out. He, again, he just attacked the flats and look at me trying. It's a fumble. JJ Swizzle with the kill shot. And we actually won. Let's go. Victory number four on the season. I'm excited. Hopefully, you guys are as well. That's the end of the video, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Love each and every single one of you guys, man. We actually won, man. Ninja, we made it. We actually won. Yeah, Menzel. Yeah. We actually won next week. We are 4-9 going up against the 3-10 and 10 Falcons. You don't want to miss it. Be there or be square.